And here we have it. The White House estate just got added into Brookhaven. And you're probably asking a few questions. What's some secrets? What's some things surrounding this new White House? Well, we're going to be going into more detail on that later. But what I wanted to do in this video was condense together a safe location guide for you guys. That way you know exactly where the safe is. You can refer back to this video if you forget or at any time of point. You know, you, you, you this might be out for a while and you're like, dude, I forgot where the safe location is in the White House estate. Well, now you know since the new White House has been introduced. This it's not labeled an RP set. This is just the Brookhaven White House. You can change it into multiple different things if you desire, but this is actually nice. Now, my reviews on this update so far is it is terrific. I've been having an absolute blast. We found a lot of the secrets and everything on live stream, so if you want a full rundown of this update from top to bottom, then you're probably going to want to look at the live stream that we just did. It is still up as a video, but guys, hit the like button for a brand new Brookhaven update before Easter even ends. Like, this is crazy, guys. The Easter egg hunt is still in Brookhaven the easter egg uh, event is still going on you can drive your egg mobiles up to the white house and it is kind of the craziest thing i i, I, I like honestly dude it's so crazy so when i came in here i was amazed you know now we can do that also a little fun fact is guys you can actually change the color of anything in here so if we want to change the the rug and uh, everything you could just change the color of that just like you can normally with your house color you could change the color of the rugs and a lot of the 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 details of inside the house so yeah make sure you don't forget that you can change the colors here it's pretty darn cool look at that boom that is pretty cool all right let's go for like a dark red on the floor kind of like a dark red Ooh, that looks very fancy look at that so yeah, and over here is where your house control commands are going to be. Uh, obviously, we'll go into this more in detail, but I, d I did want to note a few little things because this is, you know, technically the first video we're uploading on this update. So yeah, your house controls are over here, and uh, there's all kinds of cool little stuff. You can jump behind here if you want and hide in the fireplace, and then they're like, boo, hello, Mr. President. But um, yeah, just walking through the walls and appearing right in front of the president. How interesting. Um, but yeah, so we got it. even the pillows change color as well, but safe location wise guys we come up here and we see okay this is the presidential suite right is the safe in here somewhere we got the massive bathroom perhaps it's hidden in the toilet room or behind one of the showers i mean if this is the white house right it has to have one of the most secure and guarded safe locations yet that's you know, like unbelievable right well it's actually not as hard to get to as you would think and that's a surprise so if we go shift key or shift P, we can come down here and get under the the estate. Wait, wait, too far under. And you can see it right here, guys. Safe location. Look at this. Now, that's a pillar. So if we look at the pillar, then we can be like, okay, where is a pillar located? Okay, there's a pillar there and there, actually. But if we come down here, there's two pillars here too, right? So this is going to be your area of interest right here. This statue. Now, you can't just click the front of the statue or anything like this, but this is your little teleporting ticket and key to getting to that safe location. So as you can tell here, the statue is like that. But if we go behind, suddenly we can click. Now, if we decide to click on this, it will teleport us to the safe location like so. And then kaboom, isn't that the coolest thing ever? We can access our safe, get our money, close it. And then if we want to get out of here, the only way and only thing we can do is by pressing this again. And it teleports us right outside. Now, what I haven't tried that I want to try with all of you is a little bit of a search conquest for other additional secrets. So I wonder if there's a way we can actually glitch out of the safe room, okay? Because they are other places See, did you guys see that? There is other places. Oh my god, dude, we're almost there. Look. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Wait, it's like water. Wait, we're kind of glitched out. Wait, what? Guys, we're kind of glitched out. We're moving right now. Okay, so we kind of got glitched into the wall a little bit. Let's try to jump again. Wait. Okay, we're like at the pool. Now we're just floating. Wait, what just happened, dude? Holy moly, dude. I did not expect to find that. Okay. Let's see if we can teleport back out. So it is kind of possible, actually, to use your sleeping bag to be able to glitch into the under part, the, the secret basement area of the White House. Okay. Let's try this again. All right. Maybe try to place it here again. Let's try this one again. Okay. Okay. I'm not. Nothing's happening there. Okay. Let's place it right, right there. 
Okay, but you guys see there is a whole open room down here. Look at this. It's all open. So that one kind of worked. Over here, guys, we kind of got out of the safe room with the sleeping bag a little bit. Now that is surprising. Okay, now I can't even place my sleeping bag how I need to. I got like a perfect placement that one time and it allowed me to glitch out. Look at that. Now it won't even let me. Oh my God, dude. Oh my God, now it won't even let me place it. Okay, there. that's a good one, okay. Okay, so you can glitch into, oh, oh. We're technically out. We're technically out better than we were last time. And we can kind of just traverse like alongside this wall here. All the way over here. And then we can jump up. Oh, wait. Where are we now? Wait, guys. We're like under the pool. Wait, what? Uh, wait. Okay, that's a first. Now we're like under the pool. Oh, my God, dude. How does that even happen? All right, so... That's kind of crazy. There is a way to kind of glitch under the pool. I guess if you want one of the best hiding places ever, you can utilize that as a hiding place. But that's kind of crazy, dude. That is actually really crazy. So we also got this little area out here. And then we got obviously the pool that we were looking at and then the helicopter. Right now, this is one of your best ways to get a helicopter in Brookhaven through an estate. Because as you guys know, since the Easter egg event is going on right now, you cannot get access to the helicopter above the police station. So if you want your helicopters right now spawning in an estate, such as like one of the mansions or the White House, you can then get your helicopter. Because right now, the flying egg mobile is at the police station and that is kind of taking the spot you guys can kind of see it down there look at this dude the egg mobile down there look at it look at it look at it there it is that thing so that thing is currently taking away all helicopters for normal premium users above the police station so if you want a helicopter you have to get it at an estate currently or the white house well till a few days in a few days brookhaven is going to update again and then that is going to be that so that safe location, not that difficult, right? Not that difficult of a safe location. However, we didn't even scrape the surface of the secrets and things in this update. That's right, guys. Secrets are being found consistently as this update has been out. We have found a few bit of the secrets, but there are more being revealed. So if you guys find a secret in the White House, make sure to tweet it to me on Twitter or post it in the comment section below because that's going to help out a ton in helping the community get down to the bottom of every single secret in this house. Obviously, I went over how to uh, go about... Oh, look at this. We can open that. That's kind of fancy, I guess. Open the oven. Close the oven. Now, remember, a lot of these brick areas are pretty good hiding places if you want to be able to hide in here. Um, say you're trying to sneak in and spend 24 hours in the White House. You can do that. You can hide in here till it's night. Everybody's asleep, and then you can creep around and see and maybe check out the safe room. You know, I honestly thought for the safe location on this one, guys. I thought the safe location was going to be insanely more difficult. I mean, it's the White House, right? You expect it to have the most top elite security around. But I guess it, it, it doesn't always come out to be that, right? So, <laughs> so it's pretty simple there. But also, guys, this update, like I said, we're going to be covering every aspect of this update soon because there's a lot of new stuff in this update, including nine new props, auditorium, and gym updates um, that adds total new variations to the school's gym and auditorium. On top of that, there are secrets in the White House that we didn't get to cover in this video, but it is a pretty massive update, and it's on, honestly a surprise of an update, especially during the Easter season. On top of it, I love it. I'm so glad to see something like this. Now, the nine new props, you're going to have to find them yourself. They're in this huge prop catalog, so if you click through these, you're going to see a couple new ones here and there. Obviously, we're going to go in detail about that as well when we have the time to do so, but one I will show in this video that I love, it's, or I'll show my two personal favorites. If I can find them, that seems to be the problem. So right here in this video, guys, we have the punching bag, which is just so cool. I love that one. And then another one is the solar panels. Now, the solar panels is in the gaming ones, which is very weird. But these are just two of the props out of the nine that I find really nice that I really enjoyed in the prop catalog so far that got introduced in this update. But once more, we'll be going in more detail about this update and covering anything that we missed in the next video. But I needed to get this safe location to you guys as soon as possible. So with that aside, love you guys so much. We'll see you all in the next one.